Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakakwadash, double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, and citations to Yaakim, pushing this word in truth and sincerity and maturity. It's going to be a quick lesson going, uh, coming at you with the Spirit and Power, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahshai. And on today's lesson, I wanted to go into a few scriptures, uh, uh, you know, to uplift brothers on the courage that we must have because we got the Lord on our side and especially um and especially because of the times that are coming you know and you know we must have or we're gonna we're gonna need to have the spirit of the Lord to be able to go through these things that are about to come upon the planet earth knowing there's gonna be a time that has not been and none like it since the beginning man there's going to be some real dangerous times, <clears throat> perilous times that are about to come. And uh, only the men of the Lord are going to be able to resist in those times, man. All right. And then the Lord give, is with us and comforts us through the scriptures and make us make us known or makes us know that uh, 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 that he's with us. All right. And not to doubt and not to fear because Yahweh Shim Shah, he's our guide. All right. And we got examples in the scriptures of how the Lord delivered men out of temptation. And that's how, we, uh, you know, we're, we're gonna, we're, our courage is going to uh, come from, man. All right, because it tells you in, uh, what is it, Romans, uh, all scriptures, it's like the scriptures that were in before time, uh, we're in for our learning, that we may have comfort and hope in the scriptures. All right. So I want to start off here in First Maccabees uh, two and sixty two. It says, "Fear not them, fear not then the words of a sinful man, for his glory should be dung in worms." And that's right, man. Hey, we, hey, these people out here are are, are through. All right, they're, they 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 they're already lost. They're nothing but sinful men. You know, going about their own way. While we're here, we fear the Lord, man. We're serving the right, the, 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 the creator of the universe. Yahweh Bashim Yao Shai. Alright, the people now, man, their glory is gonna be but death, man. Dung and worms. Especially when Esau, you know, comes uh against us. Alright, the scripture tells you in Psalm, man, hey, uh, um, why should we fear mortal men? Alright. So it says 63. Uh, today he should be lifted up, and tomorrow he should not be found, because he is returning to his dust, and his thoughts is come to nothing. All right, but hey, we are hoping for an everlasting salvation. Uh, we're hoping to be changed, man, to live uh, forever, be immortal, becoming incorruptible. All right, so we gotta understand that, man. Hey, the Lord's with us; He has our back. All right, he hasn't appointed us to wrath, man, but to salvation. All right, this is the book of Isaiah 41 and 10. It says, Fear thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy power. I will strengthen thee. Yeah, I will help thee. Yeah, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. All right, so the Lord said, don't be dismayed. All right, and who's the Lord's right hand is Yahweh Shai. And he's going to be there in a time of need, man. All right, if we're fighting this good fight of faith, if we're defending, uh, fighting and standing up for this word, which is his right hand, which is Yahweh Shai, then he's going to protect us. All right, this is 1 Peter 3 and 30, 13. And who is he that will harm you if you if ye be followers of that which is good? You see, and, w and what's good, man, this word, this pleasant word is what's good, man, these living waters. All right. You know, and who who could harm us if we're doing if if we're, if we're uh, being diligent if if we're uh, um, tasting uh, the goodness of the Lord, man, this truth. All right, and no one. You know, and the Lord is not a man that he should lie. All right, yeah, if the heavenly Father he uh, he says something, he's he's gonna come with him, man. He's not a a a. a, a, a his word should not come back void, man. He's not like men that promises that promises things and, and don't fulfill it. All right, it's the Lord we're talking about. All right, the scripture says, is, this, is, this, is his hand too short that he cannot save? 
All right, so if 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 you're followers of that which is good, man, then no harm is gonna come towards us, man, and and that's scripture. All right, this is Sirach thirty three and one. There shall no evil happen unto him that feareth the Lord. All right, and we fear the Lord, man. You know, we hope and pray that the Lord takes not the the fear from us, man. You know, it says, but but in him, but in temptation, even a even again he will deliver him. You see. And and then what it tells you in the book of Revelation third chapter the tenth verse that uh matter of fact let me I'm gonna just get I'm gonna go get it you know Revelation um three and ten because ultimately they, they that big that big test is coming well where uh, um you saw Edom was gonna come with great wrath and he's gonna what man force this chip he's gonna, he's gonna make it mandatory he knows who we are. He knows we push the, these videos out, all right. It tells you in, in uh, Wisdom Psalm, the second chapter, that 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 our presence is irksome to, towards him, towards a uh, yes. Oh, is it? Uh, my, my fact, I'm gonna get that after this. But nonetheless, man, you saw Edom a uh, um, he hates us, man. You know, he he, uh, he he wants to, he wants to see us just destroy pursuant to the book of Psalms eighty third chapter, all right. So it says Revelation 10, uh, three and ten because thou hast kept the word of my patient, I I also keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth, all right. So hey, uh, the Lord's gonna keep us from being tempted, from from receiving that mark, all right. Because if we endure, if we keep the, if if we keep, if we suffer with the Lord to the end, man, because that's what the word patient means to to suffer. All right, you know, and this word a, you know, a, uh, we must keep it until the end, man. All right, because Esau Edom, a he's gonna come with great wrath. And as I mentioned before, I uh, said I was gonna get wisdom Solomon in the second chapter. All right. Uh, um, this is uh This is Psalms. It's like it was in Psalm two. And I'm and I'm gonna get to the point. Verse seventeen. Let us see if his words be true, and let us prove what shall happen in the end of him. For if the just man be the son of God, he will help him and deliver him from the hand of his enemies. And Esau, Edom is going to try to uh, prove that there, that we are the, the, the sons of the living power. It's in his mind to come and, 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 and put us to death, man. Just to see if, if the Lord's with us. All right. But the Lord has this man in a trick bag because the scriptures touch on my anointing. All right. And, and it also tells you uh, when the enemy should come in as a flood. All right, then the Lord should lift up a standard. All right. So hey, 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 uh, we want the devil to come for us, man, because that's when the Lord is going to uh, raise up his elect. All right. It says, verse 19, let us examine him with, with the spitefulness and torture that we may know his meekness and prove his patience. All right. Hey, Esau wants to want, 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 wants to uh, prove. If we're really uh, uh, faithful to the Most High, man, and he's going to do it in a malicious way, man. Look at the example of the seven brothers, all right, in the book of Maccabees, man. All right. You know, it, the Lord has it, got to have the Spirit of the Lord to endure such things, man. Verse 20, let us condemn him with a shameful death, for by his own saying he should be respected. All right, and that's what this devil did unto unto those seven brothers, man. Hey, but this time around, hey, we're living a time of salvation, man. The Lord's about to, you know, magnify His elect. He's about to uh, uh, make us a, a, a praise in the earth and take away our shame, man. You see, so we hey, we can't fear this devil, man. All right. Because the scripture says it, man. Let me read to Rock 33 and 1 again. There shall no evil happen unto him that feareth the Lord, but in temptation, even again, he will deliver him. All right. So we fear the Lord and we keep his patience, his word of, of uh, the word of his patience. Then, hey, the Lord's going to deliver us from all temptations. 
All right. So this is uh, uh, Isaiah 54 and 17. No weapon that is formed against thee shall prosper. And every tongue that shall rise against thee in judgment thou shalt condemn. This is the heritage of the servants of the Most High. And the righteousness is of me, saith the Lord. Man, so the Lord said this. Is he, how about Shimei Shai that's saying this? Not us. All right. So hey, ain't no evil going to come against us. No weapon. None of Esau's weapons. All right. You know, uh, 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 hey, every tongue that comes against us, man, hey, we're going to condemn to the spirit and power of the Lord. I mean, how about Shimei Shai? How should I say what, well, man? Uh, in that same hour, he would give us uh, uh, the words to speak. So if we've been, if we, if we are taken captive by this devil and, and put in concentration camp, if we're being integrate, interrogated, all right, if, we, if we're being put in, on trial, Hey, guess what, man? Hey, we're not supposed to fear this devil, man. All right? The Lord's going to give us the words to say. All right? And and, and um, he, he's going to deliver us, man. Look at uh, the example of the Apostle Paul. All right? He was put on trial. He, he got he got put in front of a gripper. And guess what, man? The Lord uh, 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 delivered him out of that situation, man. To the point where Agrippa, hey, he, 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 he believed. He, he, he he was nearly convinced, but you know this this devil he's real. Uh, uh, what's the word? Uh, he's real. Uh, basically, uh, he's not sincere for the lack of better words. But hey, hey these devils, man, hey, they, you know, uh, uh, they they they'll just mock, mock you, all right. You know, you know how these devils operate. So, the, hey, man, don't even worry about. You know, we just read wisdom of Psalm in the second chapter. He's he's gonna try our patience, man. He's gonna say, oh, he's gonna he's gonna be deceitful about it. But hey, but don't worry about it, man. Because the Lord's on our side. All right. You know, and that's some hey, that's something that uh we must meditate daily. These scriptures are are our are, are sword, our shield. All right, hey, the scriptures is, is is the is is the word is 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 our Lord, man. Yeah, how was shy? All right, and and he's our defense. He's our secure. You know, so you must believe that in these times that are coming, it, it is prophecy. It must happen. All right, and the Lord got us, man. All right, whoever trusted in the Lord and was confounded, none, no one. All right. We must be faithful to death, man. And, you know, Lord willing, we endure. And, and we're those men that get delivered out this destruction. All right. You know, and we get, we get to see a righteous kingdom be established in this in this earth. All right. So with that, Abaratza's lesson was edifying through the spirit party. How about Shimi Yashai? How about Shimi Kakudash? All right. Till next time, I say Shalom and Abar Baba.